This is a big day for me. The new wash has opened up and it's. <gasps> I had a dream we were sipping whiskey need highest floor Hey guys, so it is two Monday morning. I'm doing my makeup in my sister's room. Her room is really messy, but she has like so much makeup and I figured I should actually do it. So hey Maddie. Do we look alike? Comment down below. So good morning. It's Monday morning. I'm in Texas if you guys didn't know I'm home visiting friends and family So today I'm seeing friends are going to Dallas North Park Mall We're gonna go to a coffee shop first and get a lot of work done my stepmom just had surgery So I'm gonna drop off like a gift and flowers and stuff before then But I'm really excited because I'm going to my favorite place ever which is North Park Anyways, I wanted to tell you guys that I literally adopted a kid. Oh Coco coconut's jealous Okay, like this isn't actually clickbait like I actually I adopted a kid to sponsor through compassion But I wanted to talk about it because maybe some of you guys would want to do it. This is not like Sponsored. I mean, I don't even know how that would be sponsored, but I just felt like I needed to tell you guys Last weekend I went to a color conference, which if you guys are familiar with Hillsong, it's like the women's Conference through them anyways and they had compassion kids and I felt very compelled like I don't know it was cool anyways basically it's like $38 a month or something and it provides them with education and medical care vocational training like a community kind of a one-to-one -one relationship with me so like they can write me and stuff and then like I can write them it's just we live in a world where we're so lucky in a lot of our lives even if we don't have it great a lot of people have it a lot worse and yeah so this is Jesus and he's really cute I don't know if you guys can see him I know my family have had compassion kids in the past, but like I haven't had one so I feel very excited about this I'm not doing this in a way that's like I really don't mean this in a way that I'm like I'm great like at all I like whatsoever I I actually don't think that I am but um, if you guys are interested I'll have a link down below basically you can like sponsor a kid and give all of them that for like $38 a month Which I know $38 can be a lot to some people but also at the same time if you think about it That's like not eating out twice in LA so oh um, I'm gonna finish getting ready and we're gonna head out Reunited with Brenna finally at last. finally at last I got my stepmom my favorite treats from Trader Joe's and flowers And then I have a book too for her, but these are also my favorite flowers. So all of my favorite things <laughs> In the car, it's raining. I haven't seen Woo! rain in Actually, not that long. It's been raining. It rained a lot in LA at the beginning <laughs> of the year. But we're on our way. I'm gonna start this thing in my vlogs where it's like the what should we call it? My dancing cam. Ooh. Yeah, dance cam. Brenna, on average, if I'm in the car, how often am I screaming lyrics and dancing and being obnoxious? I would have to say 97%. I would say 97% as well. I was just going off. But basically, it's my new thing in the vlogs. And it's really just me excusing putting it in the vlogs. So if you and your friends are dancing and screaming in the car, tweet them to me. I want to see it and I want to follow oh, you guys. so cute. And it will be really, really cute. Maybe I'll even put you guys in the vlogs. We're at this cute Starbucks. I got a chai, a bagel, peppermint mocha. You always get that drink. No, I don't. No, I don't. I used yes. to. Yeah. This is a throwback day. It's a throwback day. Currently editing a video that's going up soon, but look at Brenna and her passion planner. <laughs> when I say I've converted every single one of my friends to the passion planner life, I'm not kidding. Like, name one person who doesn't have a passion planner that I'm like tight with. I can think of two boys who live in Oklahoma. Your pride and joy, me too. Oh my gosh, do you want to see mine? Of course, I have it on me. It's cute. It's really cute. Um. The gates of heaven have opened. Oh my gosh, oh, like this. Hey guys, we're at North Park. 
Brenna's behind the camera. Heck yeah. I, I branched out. I have dog bites and not the wetzel bits. And the cheese. I feel kind of weird about it. it. Last time I was here, it was Christmas. Ooh. So it was like very festive. Never been here before. I was here with Ian, and we were like walking through. And normally, his subscribers are, like really timid, but we were like walking back to the car, and she yelled my name. Aww. And it was like refreshing. It was nice. She I was should like, do that no. now. Yes. Right now. No, but I've is. never been here before. I and in the time that we have walked up, Kinsey has compared this place to heaven four times. It's a little bit blasphemous. Four. Just a little. But uh, just whatever. You know, I'm not good at this yet. Bye. This is a big day for me. The new Lush has opened up and it's oh, it's beautiful. It's so much bigger. The old one was so small. This is beautiful. Hello. It's so pretty. Okay. I know. It's, it's literally that cute. For the pizza rolls. The pizza rolls. Brenna and I are obsessed with pizza rolls. So I'm in North Park and they have a store perch. They have it other places, but mostly just here. It's Joe and I's favorite store ever. But it's literally just like home appliances, but it's so nice. So eventually when I buy a house one day, this is where I'm coming. This but it is so cool. That I need to make money so I can <laughs> I'm, I didn't think I did until today. I'm surprised that my dad doesn't know about like doesn't come to the store. Yeah. Doesn't it seem like a big thing? Yeah, totally. Like, does. <laughs> he would have that robe. He would have that robe. This stuff is so, it's just the coolest store. Also, okay. Like, here's the, they just have like crazy things. I've vlogged here before. If you guys have seen those vlogs, let me know in the comments down below. Even, okay, normally they have cooler stuff, but they have all of these. Like, this may bore a lot of you guys, but it is so cool. I want a tub like that. Hey, look at, this is, when I go home, I literally don't get ready. What? Are you in the shower? <laughs> what did this do? It, I don't know. Do you think it's... I have no idea. Maybe it's one of those... Can I click something or will the water um, You know, you click that and I'll walk back here. It might be like a body dryer too. You think that this is very like... Will you mm -hmm. me if something happens? Of course. <laughs> <laughs> We're good, thank God. It's probably not even on, Brenna. <laughs> I need lighting like this all the time. I actually do have lighting like this in my bathroom. It's really good, but this is impeccable. I'm just putting this into the universe right now. If you guys believe in prayer or law of attraction or whatever, I want a brand deal with Ugg. <laughs> That's all I want. I'm going to the new store. I love Ugg. I, I'll never get over it, and I'm not going to lie. Uh, it's very cute. If you complain one more time about your current dating status, First of all, I'm not let's complaining. I see the bright side of this. There are lots of bright sides, but you, you stole my man, Kenzie. And we are bitter about this. Brenna pain. and I will I never watch this, so it doesn't matter. But Brenna and I became friends. Well, no, not really. I started dating this guy that she had had like crush on forever. Her whole life, pretty much. And so she hated me at first. And then I dated like, I for like a long time, and we're all still friends. Like, I'm seeing him this week, and... Am I? She's still not a no. <laughs> I gotta go. Bye. About to be the most obnoxious person in the world. We're entering my favorite store. Here we go. Don't don't mess with Texas women. I'm gonna get this for Lindsay. I'm ready. Okay, so I'm literally so obnoxious. As we know, I have an undying love for Texas, and every time I come home, I get stuff from Texas Treasures, right? So I've already purchased this, but I had to buy a new one because it wasn't as clean anymore. And I had to get a large because they're out of sizes. Don't mess with Texas. Texas Treasures, if you see this, I love your work, okay? Um, I got I got this, another postcard for Lindsay, and then I got this one to put in my apartment. I got this sticker for my passion planner, and then I got another mug, because I drink out of my Texas mug all the time, even though I have about approximately 70, even though I have approximately <laughs> 72 mugs. This one's cute because it's smaller and it says don't mess with Texas, so. In case you're wondering, I'm from here. <laughs> um, I'm not a tourist. I'm a big fan of Texas. Love, love her work, you know? Yeah, yeah. Especially when it comes to the boys, the men, right? Oh my gosh, don't even get me started. Texas, the Texas boys. boys are the best. I love Texas boys. I will marry a Texas boy. Or at yeah. least they have to have lived in Texas at some point and are willing to move back at any given day. So, yeah. <laughs> hey guys, I'm back home now. I look really, really good, as you can tell. Um, 
we just ate dinner with some friends and then hung out a little bit and then drove home. I'm really tired. It is like storming outside and I don't think Coconut's ever heard thunder before because she freaked out and like hid behind me, which is kind of sad. But that is it for today's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. Obviously, normally my vlogs are not going to be me at home and these are just like way different than normal. Um, let me know if you guys want to see like certain segments or if you guys like, I really like Lily Singh's vlogs and how they're more like organized, I guess. I don't know. Let me know if you guys like that or what kind of structure or what you guys want to see in the vlogs. I also just want to say that I know a lot of you guys are younger and like Brenna has just been one of my really good friends for a long time and like was one of my best friends through like very very hard times when I was younger and I hope that you guys just have friends who are great and there for you and if you don't I will be your friend so if you guys need anyone like I'm always answering Tumblr messages and stuff like that I just don't want any of you guys to feel alone and I think with 13 Reasons Why out and all of that stuff um it's just something that I've been thinking about more and I care about you guys a lot and I want you guys to feel good and everything so um I don't know if any of that made sense or if that was just really annoying but yeah that is it for today's vlog and I'll see you soon